Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is B, back again. Um, this is my wife's 2007 Mercedes GL 450. And this vent on top got cracked. Um, I actually did it, trying to fix the garage. I was trying to get up on the hood, and my knee went through it. So now I had to order another one and um, fix it. So, try to figure out how to go about doing that. So what I'm doing is, what I'm assuming is, you have to take these screws out, which I started taking that one out. It's a couple screws um, in here and pins in the back. So I'm gonna take those out. And once I do that, I'll come back and let you guys see everything. So as you can see, I took it off that back um, little panel on the right here those little pins pop in right here it's actually six screws that come out it's one two three four five and six and those other little holes are just the little pins that go in the bracket um let me see what size um screw that is it's a t20 that takes those screws out, the T20. Um, for those screws right there, for that vent, looks like it's gonna be the T20 as well, so I'm gonna go ahead and take those out. Take loose these, this wiper hose, and get after it. Um, I ordered these vents off eBay. I got two, a left and a right. Um, and I'm gonna be taking those, putting this one in there. The other one's not cracked, so I don't think I'm gonna put the passenger side one in there. I'm just gonna put the driver side in there. Um, and then later on, if I just, if there's a big difference in like the fading or the color of the other thing versus this one, I might just go ahead and put the other one in there. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and knock that out too. Guys, I know I keep stopping or whatever, but um, I just want to give you guys all the details. So once I put it back in, I put these three screws in. One, two, three screws back in. I had to use these clamps from the old one to put on here because mine didn't come with it. Maybe yours will. But I had to take these old clamps here and here off the old one to put on here. So now I'm going to put the panel back on and... Then I'll come back and show you guys the finished product. So guys, here's the finished product. I have put the new one on. Looks pretty good. So there it is. Your 2007 Mercedes Benz GL450 hood vent. And I'm pretty sure this is probably the same process for the 350. Um, but if not, just seek um, details and stuff in there. But thanks for watching.